What is up you guys, Matt from My Process, and guys, today I want to talk to you guys um, about a topic that I've really, really just tr been trying to put into my life lately, um, and also just a story to go along with this topic, and the topic for today um, is, you know, really the importance of learning before doing, and just like keeping that balance of learning while also taking action in your life. Um, you know, so I, uh, I want to I wanna tell you guys a little story. Um, that happened to me like literally. I think I think this happened like la like last night or something. I was, on my, I was on my YouTube channel and I was and, you know I think I was like responding to my comments or something like that on my YouTube. And on the side, you know, there's like suggested videos, right? I see this one video, um, and it re it really makes me interested. And I see like the title of it, and it's like Grant Cardone goes from um, you know being a drug a drug addict to you know being um, you know making 780 million dollars like net worth or whatever. I'm saying like something something crazy or whatever. Some to where it was like a rags to riches story, um, and you know, obviously, I've heard, you know, I don't know if you guys have heard of Grant Cardone, um, but he's just like an absolute master in sales, like, master in, um, you know, in, in, in just like sales in general, and like, really, really, just like almost well acclaimed, like, as one of the best salesmen, um, like, on the planet right now. So, like, he's absolutely killing it in the game. Um, you know, so I, I, you know, so I click on this video, right, because so, I know Grant Cardone, like, obviously not personally, but, like, you know, through the internet, like, I know him, I know, like, his whole spiel, and I know, like, his whole, um, message about sales and stuff, it really interested me to, you know, hear his story, what, um, you know, how he kind of got to the position where he is, like, right now, being, like, an absolutely amazing sales guy. Um, you know, so, you know, I started, you know, I started watching this video and stuff. He started talking about, you know, how he first got started in, in sales and how he, you know, really just started getting better and better and how he really got to the position where he is today. You know, being like a really, really like, you know, master sales, you know, being like a master salesman, you know. So basically, you know, he, he was talking about, you know, whenever he wasn't selling, you know, when he was you know, just starting out, you know, whenever he wasn't selling, whenever he wasn't, you know, selling a car or selling something in his life, like, he was learning about sales, like, whether it's from mentors or, you know, videos or, you know, whatever it was, like, he was absorbing so much content, like, he was, you know, just all day, he was, be, he would be reading books, like, all night, you know, Grant Cardone would, like, come home from his, you know, from his 9 to 5 job at the car dealership, like, selling cars and stuff, and immediately, you know, he would, you know, start watching videos and reading books on sales and whatnot, like, just, like, just getting better every single day at sales. Obviously, these things started paying off, you know, he started, um, you know, selling more cars, and I think in his area, he became, like, one of the best car salesmen, like, in his little area, like, he got the most car sold you know so like that was absolutely amazing and it's funny and really this like it goes to show and all, all, you know and obviously you know he kept learning and he kept growing and he became the person that he is today as being you know one of the most well acclaimed you know salesmen to you know to live on the planet right now you know so like, really you know and like the, the you know the reason why I'm telling you guys this and the reason why you know I'm talking about this in this in this video um, is because um, you know, I think, you know, in these past couple months, like, you know, these past couple weeks or months, um, of my social media marketing business, you know, I've been, you know, I've been DMing, I've been doing the hustling and stuff like that. I've been DMing hundreds of, hundreds of, hundreds of people, or personal brands on, you know, on Instagram, rappers, producers, athletes, like that, you know, that whole bunch. But the thing is, is like, I could never close a client, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's my biggest struggle. It's like, my, me and my business partner and I is like, our business, our biggest struggle. Like, that's, this has been a really big setback. We would, you know, we would send out these DMs and stuff like that. We would get responses, you know, we would hop on the calls, you know, we would do all the great stuff, but like we could just never close the client. We never knew how to do that. We never knew how to like fully convince someone that like this social media marketing thing is the best thing for their brand. And if they sign with us right now, you know, they'll be set and you know, that whole burden of social media marketing will be taken off their shoulders and they, they'll be getting so many sales and so many, you know, so much exposure and so much traffic to their brand and to the music. You know what I'm saying? Like whatever it is, guys, like, you know, we, we got like, we, we were not able to fully, fully, fully you know, like sell these people on that social media marketing idea, um, or at least, you know, selling us at, you know, selling us as to why we are the best at, you know, what we do and stuff. So, um, you know, and it's really been a struggle lately, but I realized, um, you know, like, you know, through doing all this, you know, one, I'm trying and I'm learning through each DM, like, I'm, I'm trying to experiment with different things. You know, it's just hard because, um, you know, even though, you know, I do, you know, I feel like, you know, I'm a, you know, I feel like I'm a pretty decent salesman, like, obviously I'm still young, like, I still have a ton to learn. I feel like I'm, you know, somewhat decent at sales, um, but I, I just feel like there's a whole nother world of sales I just don't even know about, you know what I'm saying? Like, there's just so many things that, you know, I don't even think of, you know, when I'm DMing, a, uh, when I'm DMing, like, a, cl a potential client, or, you know, man, or when I'm messaging one, or I'm on the phone call with them, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, there's just so many things that go into it. 
um, that go into sales and that go into effectively selling an idea or or myself um, on on this idea on this idea of social media marketing like you know there's this whole world that I haven't discovered yet um, and I feel like the only way to truly discover that is to not only you know do and learn from the experiences but to also you know learn from people who are doing it people from who are masters people who are have become successful in sales who have become successful in their own business because of them being able to master sales being able to master that skills of those skills of being able to sell some an idea or sell some a product or sell a service or sell you know a person you know what I'm saying so like it's just so crucial, um, you know, and, and I really, it's so crucial to just, you know, not only do and not only learn from experiences, but to also learn, you know, just, you know, the basics and learn, you know, the foundation and learn, you know, from people who are, um, from, who are better than you so that you can, you know, elevate your mindset, elevate the information that you already know and make it even better so you can take that information that you put and then that you get in these videos or in these podcasts or in these books that you read from sales. Um, or that, that I'll read from sales or whatever, and then I can convert that into my everyday action, my everyday DMs, so I can ultimately, you know, have a better conversion rate, because guys, like, you know, I'm DMing, like I said, like, hundreds of people, like, me and my business partner, hundreds of people, you know what I'm saying, but we're just not getting the closes, like, we're not getting the clients, even though we're putting in the work, we're hustling and whatnot, but we're not, you know, we, you know, we're somewhat learning from our mistakes, but if we don't have a solid foundation of sales and how to actually sell someone on this social media marketing idea, then I mean, like, you know, we could, you, we could, we could send thousands of DMs and it wouldn't matter because we could never, you know, fully close, you know, a potential client. But, you know, the lesson for you guys you know, in your life, like, you know, before you, um, you know, it, it really just try to keep that balance of not only doing and hustling in your life, like every single day. But also, you know, learn as you're going on that journey, you know, whether it's learning from your mistakes that you're making while you're doing or just learning from podcasts or learning from, you know, books or learning from mentors or learning from people, influencers on social media, like whatever you, whatever you know, your niche is, you know, whatever dream you're pursuing, you know, don't only just do every single day, but you also have to learn as well and be able to, you know, um, learn things and learn information from your niche so that you can apply that. So you can apply that information that you're getting and put it into your everyday hustle, into um, you know the things that you're doing every single day to you know help become you know help become successful in your life, you know. Um, so you know, guys, I mean that's basically you know the overall message, and I really hope to um, you know you can put that in your, inside of your life. And I know that you know now that I've had like a deep understanding of you know what I'm going to do. Um, like, of like the daily hustle and whatnot, like I, I, I really need to pair that with just learning and being able to consistently, um, you know, keep learning about sales and learning about advertising and learning about, you know, just this whole world of social media marketing and this whole world of sales and, um, and whatnot that, you know, is really um, an important aspect to, you know, anything that you're doing in life. Like sales guys, like no matter what industry you're in, no matter if it's business or any, you know, no matter what it is, guys, like sales is just, uh, you know, s such an important aspect um, of your life, you know what I'm saying, and, and it's just so important to be able to have that skill, um, and I'm sure it will take, that, you know, having that sales skill, being able to sell yourself or something or a service, um, you know, that will take you for the rest of your life, you know what I'm saying. Like I said, yeah, I'm going to put this into my life, and I hope you guys can put this into yours. So guys, you know, overall, just keep that balance of, of learning and also doing, um, and be able to apply what you learn in, um, in those courses and in those, um, and, and you'll be able to apply what you learn in those courses, in those books, in those podcasts, from those mentors, and apply it to you know your everyday hustle, the things that you're doing every single day to um, ultimately become successful, guys. So, so guys, this is the this is road to social media marketing success number eleven. <laughs> yeah, you know, I hope you guys are getting some value out of this uh, from this series and from this. I haven't made from and from this whole you know journey. Um, I haven't really made a social media marketing video in a little while in a little while, but I'm happy I'm back into it. Um, but like I said, guys, I hope, you know, this adds a ton of value to you guys in your life and in you know, your everyday hustle of pursuing your dream and becoming successful in your life. Um, so I hope everyone has an absolutely amazing day. I love you guys, and just keep loving the process. I will see you guys later.